Anna. And we are the Rip Kitchens. Welcome back to our channel. to recreate each other's Instagram photos. Obviously not all of them because we'd be here all day. Actually longer, an eternity. So we've gone on each other's account, had a little stalk, and we've each picked four Instagram photos we would like to copy. That's right. Now we want to see which of us can recreate each other's photos the best. So we're actually going to have a judge who's going to judge each round. Yes, it's not up to us, it's up to the judge. I'm gonna be judging hard and fair. I'm not picking sides. I'm not gonna favor anyone. And no, there's no bribery. I don't care how much popcorn and Maltesers you give me, it's not happening. Let's see who's better at attention to detail and copying the outfits and the setting. Literally everything, everything has to be perfect. It's probably gonna be harder than we think. We have to find those clothes. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And give it a big thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to click that grey bell next to the subscribe button so you'll be notified every single time we post a video. Okay, let's do the first photo. Hi, Sam at the back. The first photo I'm going to recreate of Sam is this one. I love that photo so much. And this is probably one of my favourite photos that Sam's ever uploaded on Instagram. Thank you. Alright, so here's the special location. to wear an anklet. You're wearing an anklet. <gasps> is that a, what's it called? Why aren't you wearing an anklet today? I could steal yours. Because mm, you don't wear anklets, so I didn't have to put one on. I think that's just going to lose you some marks. Dun, dun, Depends dun. on me the judge. Yeah. You didn't wear an anklet, Tegan. How am I supposed to judge properly if you didn't wear an anklet? Alright, here it goes. toes back a little. That's it. I think we got that. That looked pretty spot on to me. Really? Yeah, that's what I love to hear. Oh, it looks so pretty. Okay, so it's like pretty much identical and if you didn't know the two of your part, you wouldn't even be able to tell that you were different people. The only difference is the anklet. I'm gonna be marking points for this. All right, Tegan, how do you think you went for the first one? So I got the location, I got the outfit, the hair. Talking about hair, what the heck is going on here? I think I did okay. Yeah, I reckon that one's gonna turn out really good, but you guys Come can on, help Georgie. decide. Also, you know you love me. Don't listen to her. Pick me, Bella. I love you more. Don't be convinced by this. Just stick to what you think, okay? Love you, Bella. I don't know which one loves me more. I think it's quite even, but I do get constant notes on my fridge of who loves me more, so I don't know. I'll give you some chocolates later, some Maltesers. And popcorn. No, if you pick me. <laughs> See, I told you you guys would bribe me. So this was Tegan's location. Mine is over there on the poles. <laughs> So my first photo is this one and I chose this one because it was a trick one and Tegan was doing a trick one so I was like I'm gonna pick a trick one too. So as you can see I'm wearing the matching bikini top and the grey pants. I gotta try and pick the exact pole that Tegan did it on. How the heck am I gonna know that? I didn't even remember. Dude, help me out. Tell me which pole it was. Nah. We gotta look at the background. What is in the background? It's just rocks and water. Well. I swear those bins weren't there either. These are my poles, but I gotta pick one. I remember this being hard to do last time, so. <laughs> my mistake. Yeah, I have to go lower, guys. Yeah, because my <laughs> Tegan's chin is like on the water horizon. Okay, let's go. Me up there. If I just look, I'll think that was me. 
points for photography, Valor. Looks pretty good. To Sam me. said, "Good boy." All right, a million hand sends later to make sure we got the perfect. Where? Mom. <gasps> Tiggs, did you actually leave your shoes outside? Oh my god. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the converse. <gasps> well. So here's the finished product. Again, if I didn't know the two of you apart, I couldn't tell who was who in that photo. Uh, Teague's good photography. You don't get an extra point for that, but I enjoy the photography. There are bins in the background of yours, Sam, but not in Teague's, but your hair is slightly different. And I don't mean as in your hair is the same, but Teague's has got more hair like flying everywhere. But again, you can't really control that. Other than that, it's pretty spot on. So I'm a... Uh, right in my book again so i just want to add that i had like an audience because it was apartments and they were just like there were people watching so i had that added pressure bella so just keep that in mind you know what's wrong with an audience i hope that made you perform better was there any cute boys there all right tegan it's your turn to recreate me again this is the photo i'm trying to recreate of sam <laughs> Oh my god, Sam, this is like my favourite photo of you. I'm so happy that you're doing this one, Diggs. You're laughing, Don't know what she was thinking. Excuse nah, me. Nah, hers look better than this. I'm my hair perfectly done. I'm not insulting the hairdresser, but I didn't know how to recreate her look. Tiggs, I'm actually really impressed by your hair. I think that's pretty good effort considering that you did it yourself. I was wearing that exact crop top. Very good. And you can see that she's got blue eyeshadow on mm -hmm. in the photo. So smoky. I've tried to recreate a smoky blue eye. Look, how'd I do Bella? I'm so happy you did blue eyeshadow because I told Sam the other day that I loved her blue eyeshadow for the mermaid challenge. So now you can both do blue eyeshadow and wear it more often. This actually was a photo shoot. So we've created that ourselves with a piece of material. <laughs> this is how you make an at-home photo shoot. Yep. Actually, we're not done. <laughs> Hello, we're in a the studio. There's black on the floor because we had black floor, didn't we? It was like tart cat, wasn't it? And we put this stuff underneath so that it's not slippery because obviously material on the floor is very slippery. So hopefully that works. I don't even think I would have thought about putting that non-slip stuff underneath the fabric. So I'm impressed. All right, we're having a few difficulties because clearly I'm not a professional photographer. I don't know much about lighting and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Also, we're going to turn off the lights to see if that makes the light we're using work better with the photo. So now it's up to Bella to decide. First of all, I'm actually super impressed that you even tried to do this photo because being in like a studio and doing proper photography, and as Jordan Matter would say, compared to doing it to an iPhone, is much different. But I'm very impressed. Okay, there's a few things that are different in this photo. Tiggs, you have a bracelet and a ring, two rings on, and Sam doesn't have anything on. So you might lose some points for that. But I'm actually super impressed by this photo and super impressed, Sam, by your photography. You get a pretty good score for that one, I would say. Okay, so I'm in my next outfit for photo number two that I'm copying of Tegan. This is it. It's an activewear set. I believe we took this photo straight after a challenge that we did and I happened to wear blue and Tegan wore this. That was the 10 second acro gymnastics challenge. If you want to go check that out after. If not, that's all good. <laughs> Alright, so we just arrived at the beach. <laughs> Tegan and I have like different style, like different technique to our leaps. Huh? So, what? So this is getting hard. I have to try and adapt to What's Tegan's this? technique. Excuses? No, Bella. These are. <laughs> Get out! I'm hearing excuses. Sorry. It's just showing how hard I'm working for this photo. Nah, don't feel sorry for her, Bella. I don't ask for sympathy. Sam, that's what I'm 
soft sand too. Oh. Too much on like this. That looks pretty good to me. You guys are so cute. This is so good. Okay, point on like the exact same facial expression. A good pick on the scrunchy, Sam. I like that. And yeah, it's almost identical. The difference is again the clouds, but I'm not deducting points for that. <laughs> you can tell that you guys prefer different legs in your legs uh, because Tegan's left leg is higher and Sam, your right leg is higher. And that's because Sam, your right leg, and Tegan, your left leg. Other than that, this is like super, super, super close. So I'm like really impressed with that. And um, I'm gonna just write that down in my book. Let me just find my page. We can recommence. Oh, what a hairstyle. The next photo I'm recreating of Tegan is this pic. Sam is riding and we're driving. We totally don't have a car that our bikes fit in. We haven't got like one of those things that you put in the back of your car where you put your bikes on. We should really invest. So we're following Sam to the location. She'll appear in a moment. This bike is dodgy. Do you hear this? Yeah. Wouldn't be surprised if this bike just fell apart, really. Because <laughs> Tegan made it. Thanks. Oh, hi, Sam. Let's roll. Show sure. I like it, though. Come on, Tegan. What a nice bike. <gasps> Look at those pretty flowers. <laughs> Sam, did you see the... Purple ones over there. Back, back, Sam. I think they're in someone's house, so we should Let's probably go home. door knocking. <laughs> oh, puffed. Tegan's reaction to this flower thing. She's gonna love it. Oh my god, the flowers are so pretty and they're so pink. I can't wait to see what Tegan says. Look at this, guys. I swear there's more flowers than when I did it. Oh yeah, I reckon there is. <gasps> I wish this was in my backyard. It looks so pretty. <gasps> Tegan, I reckon you wish that this was in your room. I want this in my room. <laughs> huh. What did I just say? I know you too well. All right, let's do this. So guys, these photos were taken at different times of the year, as you can see, because this tree is now in flower. And when I took the photo, it wasn't. I don't know if this is a disadvantage, because like the background's different. It is, it's completely different. Points must be deducted. No points for how pretty it is. Okay, let's do this. Gonna stand like Tegan. Don't mind me, guys. This is my next outfit. I don't just dress like this just to take a picture of Sam. I even brought my own comb for, you know, to make sure my hair looks as good as, looks as, good as yours. What was that, Sam? Did you say my hair looked good? Yeah. Sam, that is preparation right there. Is there um, a nice little image on the wall next to your flowers? Hmm. Sam. What? <laughs> it was, it's been there. Do you think I've done it, Sam? Oh, yeah. Yours is just better. <laughs> Why does my hair not look as long? Oh, it's still cool, like, yeah, it's really good. Like, plus, once you put the preset, presets work wonders. All right, we done? <laughs> Bella, how did I do? Really bad. Tegan, but I think the flowers look so much nicer in Sam's photo. The bike's obviously the same, you guys are wearing the same clothes, you're literally posing the same, apart from your hair being different. I think, Sam, I think you combing, combing your hair actually made your hair not like Tegan's, because hers looks like it hasn't been as combed, but whatever. It just, it's a really pretty photo, and I really hope you post it on your Instagram. I'm off to recreating my last photo of Sam. 
We actually have to go to our friend's house. She won't even know because we're social distancing and we'll just like, bro, I texted her. Oh, did you? Yeah. That is classic Sam and Tegan. Tegan's always the one that messages. Yeah. She won't even know with her. Yeah. So let's go. <gasps> let's do a cool transition. We should jump. One, two, three. Let's go. I want a bank. So we've arrived at the location. To our right, we have some llamas. Aw, cutie. Let's get in position. Bring your left shoulder up. To the left hip a little bit more. Lengthen your arms a little bit more. I can't lengthen them anymore. Lengthen them. Do your head more. I'm fully like leaning on <laughs> Do you know what sucks about this is I had a really nice skyline, I had a beautiful yeah. sunset, and unfortunately today it's then we were taking That's a little bit of a disadvantage, but Bella, I think that's a really disadvantage. No, she's fine. How'd I do? What's up? <laughs> Hi boys! I hope that's what you said, right? Call me! <laughs> <laughs> we uh, just noticed that there's grass in my photo and yeah, the sand in this one. It's your cross. I think they're redoing something. So the grass is gone. It's fine because we got some of the llamas. Yeah. So yeah, that is a major difference, but like we can't help that. And so the sunset, Bella. Like it's a massive difference. <laughs> Things are not working in my favor. Guys, look at my necklace. Yeah, that's a Sam necklace. I look. Well, I'm literally high Sam and low right that. now. I think I'm the winner. Just because you put my neck. Excuse me, I found that necklace and put it in your room for you to wear. Bro, I found this outfit for you to wear. Excuse me, I went in your room and got this outfit. Yeah, I told you where it was. Yeah, on the floor. We all <laughs> okay, Bella, it is up to you. How did Tegan go? Really good. Okay, wow, that's actually so good. All right, apart from sunset and the grass and whatever, I won't take points off for that because you can't control Ellie's grass and you couldn't control the weather. There is like the most minuscule of differences in this photo. Um, Sam's bag is slightly tilted and Tegan's is like full straight. Oh, being super, super picky. Um, Sam's only got one, her one Sam necklace on and Teague's you have two necklaces on. But other than that, like, you guys did a really good job. Your positioning is just perfect. You did a really good job. I enjoy this a lot. And Tiggs, you should post that. Overall, that was so good. It was so close. Literally the only difference. Okay, so other than like the weather and stuff in every photo, like the clouds or the sunset or whatever, the only slight, tiny, instant little point that I took off in all of them was in your second photo, Tegan, where you had all your rings on and bracelets on for the photo that you were doing with Sam in the studio. But other than that, it was so close. But I have to announce the winner as Samantha! Yeah! Woo! As is. Yeah! Bella got picky. <laughs> oh, dang. No. Thanks, Bella. Mwah. Pay you later. It's okay. Now the reasons were fair enough. Oh my gosh, I won. Guys, I won. Last challenge we did the mermaids, I lost. So this is great. You also lost on the obstacle. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks guys for tuning in. We really hope you enjoyed this in your isolation. Special thank you to Bella for featuring and being our special guest judge. You and did what such an amazing, amazing job. Thanks so much for asking me to do this, guys. I loved doing it. It was so much fun watching you recreate all your photos. And it's so sad that we're in isolation right now and I can't see you guys. So at least I got to see a little snippet of what you guys have been up to. And uh, hopefully see you guys all soon. Thank you. Beautiful work. Thank you so much for being today's judge. I won't hold it against you, but you chose Sam. I still love you. That's it from us, guys. Remember, we post every single week. We'll see you next week. See ya. Bye, Felicia. Bye. Imagine if your name was Felicia. Bye.